Hey everyone, welcome back to yet another Star Stable video. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and go check out my other videos if you haven't already. And today, we're actually going to be showing you all 75 locations, so let's just get right into the video. Now, let's go see the items that we get with all of the 75 golden horseshoes. Uh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, no one's loading in. Okay, don't mind that, you guys. I swear it's fine. Okay, so this is how you get them. You just go up- Oh, gosh, I'm very concerned. Okay, anyways, you go up to this birthday leader who is invisible on my screen, but she'll load in soon, please. And then you're just going to click happy birthday and exchange for all of the items. So we're just going to do that real quick. All right, so now let's go take a look at- Everything you can get with all of the golden horseshoes. Wow, that's a lot. Okay, <laughs> so this is the saddle pad. I mean, it's pretty cute. And we got the leg wraps. We also have the saddle bag. And I'm pretty sure it's western inspired because we have a western hat and everything like that. And we have western boots. We also have a fabulous birthday dress and a fabulous birthday top. So we're just gonna wear the fabulous birthday top and this is basically what the outfit looks like and let me know what you think about this outfit down in the comments because there's been some- Oh, we forgot that. Okay, we're good now. But rate it out 10 and let me know what you think. So yeah. Okay, so here we are at Moreland and the first one is right behind the trailer over by this little area back here. The next one is over here by this little paddock area outside and it's just over here kind of hidden in the corner. The next one is in the middle of this big arena near the Bobcats Club. The fourth one is over here near the Moreland Forge and it's just right here near the fireplace. The fifth one is right here in the championship arena in the lower left hand corner. The sixth one is over here on the beach right behind her house. That's the sixth. The seventh is all the way down here near the Moreland fishing area and here are the coordinates. Just in case you're struggling to get here, it's right over here and this is where it is. The eighth is right outside Moreland on this side of the house. The ninth is right over here near the dancing area in Moreland. It is up this little hill and slope. It's kind of on the championship route, but here it is. The tenth is along the Moreland beach, kind of in the very corner near Nomers Island. The next one is right up here, kind of near the forge, and it's just right there. Another golden horseshoe is right up here, kind of in this like waste construction site area. There is another golden horseshoe right down from this area and it's just straight ahead right here. The next golden horseshoe is right around Silverglade and it is right on the side there. And the next one is right as you enter Silverglade. It should be right in the fence. The next golden horseshoe is right inside where you get your club made. Yeah, there's a little area behind that and you should be easy to find right there. The next one is near the broken wall where you guys glitch to stand on top of the house in a silver glade. The next one is behind these houses in silver glade, basically kind of on the right. The next one is right behind this tractor in Steve's farm. The next one is by the Frisian horses and you could just grab that. The next one is in this field of wheat and it's just outside Steve's farm right here. The next one is right outside the Silver Glade Castle. So there is actually a few at Marley's. The first one I'm going to show you guys is right straight over here and you guys can already see it. It's right near the Mustangs and it's in this little open area, you know, all good, all good. The next one is near the Western Race. If we just come over here, you guys probably saw it already, but it is right near this wagon over here. The next one is over near this area right above this paddock and it's right here, right in plain sight. So it should be pretty easy to find. The next one is in this championship area and it's basically just the Silver Glade Championship and it's right here next to the schedule. There is one right outside this cafe, right when you exit the trailer. There is another one right outside the stables here on the right. There is another one right in the entryway to Fergrove, so there we go. And if we head to the championship area, 
There is another one right by this tree on the right of the championship area. There is another golden horseshoe right up this way. Basically, over here is the stairs or the little passageway to get to Veildale Lake, so there's just one over there. There is another one right in the middle of this big silver glade sand pit area, so just want to grab that. And if we come over here, nearby the pet shop over here, where you get that big squirrel chipmunk at, there is another one behind those trees. It's basically this path that you take all the way back from here. So yeah, that is where it is. There is another one right up this path from over here. You're going up the mountain. It's just here right on the right of it. And then if you continue up the mountain, there is another one right up there on the log. And here is the next one. There is another one near the dead tree over here. Well, not dead. Magical tree over here, yes. On the mountain, and it should be pretty easy to find. Down from Veildale. If you're going to Veildale Lake from the mountain, there should be one on this path. Just in case you guys need coordinates, since it's a little bit more tricky, here they are, and here I am on the map. The next one is if you're going to the championship area taking this road, it should just be on the left over here, and right here it is. The next one is up here. It's basically the Red String Trail Ride route, and it's just all the way up here. Here's the coordinates just in case you're struggling. The next one is straight from here, and again, here are the coordinates just in case. But it should be pretty easy to find. Once you cross that log section over there, just continue going straight, and it should just be right there. And the last one is at the end of the Red String Trail Ride, and it's just all the way up here. Again, the coordinates are just in case, but it should be pretty easy to find. And that was the last one. Congratulations! So I'm in Fort Pinta and the first one is here in these stables. The second one is if you come out and over near um, James, there should be one right on this ledge. And that is the second one. Okay, so there's actually a lot up here, so be careful not to miss these, you guys. If you come over here and continue on, there should be a little area to go up by and you just want to take this route up into this area and there should be another one over here all right so the fourth one is in the third house you pass through and you just want to go on top of it as well and here it is this is the fourth golden horseshoe this is the sixth and it is right outside of Fort Pinta, so it should be easy to find. Alright, so if you go along the racetrack, there should be quite a few. So this is the seventh golden horseshoe at Fort Pinta. And then there is another one right over here by the little lifeguard stand, so be sure you collect that one as well. And if you come around from this area, there is another one over here near the rocks, so I'm just going to take it. Yes. And behind this little shop, I guess, there is quite another one, so <laughs> we can just go ahead and take that one as well. And then over here on this little kind of roundabout area of the pool, there's another one next to Ellen. Yes, Ellen. And on the pony boat, all the way in the corner, there is yet another golden horseshoe. And then if we come around this corner and right ahead of us, there's actually another golden horseshoe. You guessed it. And up here on the little stairway, there is another golden horseshoe. And if we come around the racetrack, there is a golden horseshoe. Yes. And if we continue on the racetrack, there is another one behind the little area here. The first golden horseshoe is in plain sight in the stables, and it's right here. Second golden horseshoe is on the way to Dino Valley, and it is just right on the path. The third golden horseshoe is down in Paris Workshop, near the crafting stations. Next golden horseshoe is I'm over by this Druid guy's house, and there's a little path, and if you follow it back, there is a golden horseshoe at the end of it near the waterfall. And there is a golden horseshoe right outside the championship area on the left. And if you continue, continue past the championship area, there is one on that path as well. And there is yet another golden horseshoe at the back of this house. Past the championship area, it should just be straight from it. And there is another golden horseshoe right on the edge here. This is the coordinates, and basically it is just near the water. The next golden horseshoe was right across from it. 
And if you just fall down from Veildale, you can see the trailer back there. It should just be right here. Oh, the next one is right behind the stables and it should be in clear sight. The next golden horseshoe is behind Elizabeth's house right here and it is in the corner. The next one is on the path towards the Druid training paddock right above the stone circle. There is another one right here near this cow and it is across from the trailer. There is another golden horseshoe right down from the Veildale race. Bye everyone, thank you so much for watching this Star Stable video. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and yeah, bye!